Well, Craig, the police major, who's now the interim police chief, says the changes at the top of this department will not affect how police protect and serve our community. We're still going to keep doing business the same way we have been every day. We're still going to be out there serving our citizens. Right now, Major Dean Pitts is the interim police chief. He's a 25-year veteran officer, but he does not want the job full time. My career is winding, winding down to a close, and I'm just looking forward to moving on to different things. He was with former chief Kevin Lindsay when Lindsay commented about wearing black face in regards to the low number of African Americans on the force. Right now, out of 150 officers, there's one African American officer. What he said wasn't aimed at any particular person. Uh, it, it wasn't meant to be derogatory. I, I understood what he was saying, but uh, you know, it, it, it came out wrong. It's, it's over with. I mean, he's resigned. There's not really an investigation. There was a complaint about a, a, a comment that he made, and he acknowledged and admitted to the comment. So what's more to investigate? Two majors in the police department have said they may want to be the next chief. The salary, ninety to $95,000. But the job comes with some challenges like shrinking budgets and pending lawsuits. Right now we have to leave 13 sworn police officer positions vacant right now. And uh, you know that, that makes it more difficult. Now ultimately it will be up to the new city administrator to decide who the new police chief will be. The start date when the city administrator starts here in Fort Smith has not been announced yet, but it's expected to be sometime this month. Live in Fort Smith, Brett Raines, 4029 News.